It's a daily struggle. Some days it's just total chaos. Playing out for parents nationwide. Had to do everything on top of your normal duties and then some. Parental burnout, feeling overwhelmed, overwork, and plain exhausted over long periods of time. A challenge Kate Golick knows firsthand. As a working mother of four living near Columbus, Ohio, and a professor at the Ohio State University's College of Nursing. There was one point during the pandemic where I really felt like I was being forced to be this superhuman. I had to be an elementary school teacher. I had to be a caregiver. I had to be a spouse, a cook, a cleaner. I had to be emotional support for everyone. And it's not feasible for you to have to take on so many different roles. And it's inevitable almost that there's not some degree of burnout present. Which is why she co-authored a new study just released today that found that out of more than 1,200 parents surveyed in the middle of the pandemic, 66% of them reported burnout, a phenomenon that was more common among women and in homes with two or more children. When we talk about burnout, how do you distinguish that from just a pretty rough day or being tired one day? Burnout in parents is that physical, emotional, over exhaustion and that feeling of just, I need a break. And I think it's very shaming for parents to think that they can be burned out in this role of being a parent, you know, because obviously we all love our kids and it's too much on us to be asked to do all of these different things. What happens as a society if we do not address this problem? I do feel like it's a public health problem. It's not that I'm depressed. It's not that I'm anxious. It's actually that I'm just burned out in this role. And it can manifest in harmful ways. In some cases, the research shows anxiety and increased alcohol consumption for parents, along with increased likelihood of insults or even physical harm through spanking aimed at children. As for the kids, parents experiencing burnout reported they saw more signs of unhappiness, more trouble concentrating, and increased difficulty interacting with other children. The good news, says Dean Bernadette Melnick, who co-authored the study with Golic, is that there are also strategies that can help. Things like being kind to yourself and lowering expectations, asking for help, or talking to someone you trust, and self-care, even something as small as five-minute recovery breaks. For parents who are struggling with this feeling of burnout every single day, what can they do? Take two minutes, make a hot drink, sit, sip it slowly, focus on the present moment, count your blessings, not what you don't have. Just four to five abdominal deep breaths can so relieve stress. It's these types of simple practices that can make a big difference for anybody who's stressed. A tiny bit of advice for parents everywhere, taking it one step at a time. Mm. Everybody in these chairs, we're, we're all nodding yeah. our heads. We have felt that, yes. those feelings. It's so interesting how they say even just getting up to make yourself a cup of tea is a yeah. recovery break. And the researchers also give this checklist. So if you look What's at the study there? included, it's a Did it's you a make helpful... four copies? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> have plenty for everybody. Check, and it check, really tells check. you where you are on the burnout scale. Oh. So it's usable to tell you you're feeling, you know, I feel easily irritated or I feel that I'm not a good parent. And you yeah. can check sort of where you are and so you can manage accordingly. Oh, yeah. That's good. I'm mean, lowering that. expectations. Yeah. I, I like that yeah. that, uh, that, yeah. that nugget especially. By the way, we should mention that you can find this self-check scale. It's on our website, uh, today.com. Check it out, today.com. Thank you, Morgan. Thank yeah. you, Morgan. Yeah. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. Mr. Roker. And hey, guys, by the way, this feeling of, those feelings are going to pass in about 15 years when they go off to college. <laughs> I feel great. <laughs> great. Anyway, uh, <laughs> Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.